Hi, we're at the Christiana Skating Center with the Diamond State Roller Girls, and they've promised not to hurt me too bad, so let's hope they keep that promise. friends when I was little and then I didn't know about this resurgence that happened in 2000 and then um, as soon as I found out about it I was like looking up local teams and there was nothing in Delaware um, so I hooked up with Nikki. We exchanged email addresses and then we met up like a week later. It was pretty quick. We met up like a week later and that was in February of 06, 05 and then I think within four weeks we were practicing together so it started out with five of us. So. I think it was very theatrical when we first started. That was kind of how we learned uh -huh. by watching other teams. Yeah. I think that in the past two years, we've definitely gotten much more serious about the athletic piece. You don't want to communicate loudly to everybody what you're doing. You can just put your hands like this, you know, do that little motion, and all the girls on your team know exactly what you want to do. So it's a way of training everybody to think and speak the way you do. Obviously, they're, they're going to be more aggressive when they're on skates, the adrenaline's pumping. But, but for the most part, it's an extension of their personality, maybe an exaggerated version. I mean, that's why we all like it so much, is that. It's, it's a huge confidence boost for people. It's a, it's a great, productive, safe outlet for a lot of people. Um, and it brings a lot of us together who may not really know each other otherwise. Our rink can hold 1,200 people, so obviously our goal is 1,201. <laughs> and we do a lot of charity stuff, so when people come in and they give to the league by, you know, then we're able to do more in the 